A new study suggests that the most deadliest form of brain cancer, glioblastoma, doesn't just invade the brain, but it can actually eat your skull. That's right, scientists at Albert Einstein College of Medicine discovered that glioblastoma can actually erode the skull bone and alter the immune cells that live in skull marrow. So inside of our bone marrow is where immune cells and other blood cells forms. And so these skull erosions are hypothesized that they may actually allow glioblastoma, the cancer, to transmit signals to the marrow and change its landscape. So basically that means that glioblastoma may not just be an isolated brain disease like we thought, but more of a systemic disease. So it interacts with the bone and immune pathways we never thought were connected. Now these skull to brain channels actually allow an influx of these numerous pro-inflammatory cells from the marrow to the tumor. So it renders glioblastoma increasingly aggressive and often untreatable. Now, these researchers also found that even treatments that are aimed at protecting the bone, like osteoporosis medicines, can actually backfire and make the tumor more aggressive in mice. This is a major shift in how we understand brain cancer, and it may help explain why current therapies, all of them dealing with glioblastoma as an isolated brain disease, have failed. So hopefully, this will help us understand glioblastoma a little bit more and lead to better treatment strategies.